nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Saint Lawrence was one of the seven deacons in charge of giving help to the poor and needy under Pope Sixtus II, who suffered during the persecution of Emperor Valerian in 258. When a persecution occurred, Sixtus was condemned to death. Saint Lawrence, who seeing Sixtus, his bishop, led to execution, began to weep not at his sufferings but at the fact that he himself was to remain behind. With these words, he began to address him, Where are you going, father? Where would a father go without his son? Where would a holy priest go in haste without his deacon? You've never offered sacrifice without an attendant. What are you displeased at in me, my father? Have you found me unworthy? Prove then whether you have chosen a fitting servant to him whom you have entrusted the consecration of our Lord Jesus' blood, to whom you have granted fellowship in partaking of the sacraments, to him do you refuse to take part in your death? Beware lest thy good judgment by endangered whilst thy fortitude receives its praise. Abraham offered his son, Peter sent Stephen on before him. Do you, Father, show your courage in your son? Offer me whom you have trained that you confident in your choice for me may reach the crown in worthy company. Sixtus said, I do not leave you behind nor abandon you. Greater struggles are waiting for you. Old men have to undergo easier fight. A more glorious triumph over the tyrants is waiting for you, a young man. You will come soon and cease weeping. After three days you will follow me. Let the weak disciples go before their master, let the brave follow him, that they may conquer without him, for they no longer need his guidance. So Elijah left Elisha. To thee I entrust the full succession to my own courage. The prefect of Rome, a greedy man, thought the church had a great treasure hidden away. So he ordered Lawrence to bring the church's treasure to him. The saint said he would in three days. Then he went through the city and gathered together all the poor and sick people supported by the church. When he showed them to the prefect, he said, This is the church treasure. In great anger, the prefect condemned Lawrence to a slow, cruel death. The saint was tied on top of an iron grill over a slow fire that roasted his flesh little by little. But Lawrence was burning with so much love of God that he almost did not feel the flames. He was burned on top of great iron for three days and after three days he said, the flesh is roasted, turn it and eat. So by the courage of his mind, he overcame the power of fire. St. Lawrence Ora Pranobis, in nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and leave a comment down below. God bless you all.